So, I'm going to show you how to make a five minute chocolate cake. And yeah. So, first of all, what you need is you need some um, all purpose flour, you need some cane sugar, you need vanilla, vanilla. You need a whisk, a spoon, two eggs, actually one, sorry, I'm going to put this one egg away. So. so you need one egg and whipped cream or home style cream cheese frosting or any frosting is optional. And then I only did that because I can burn the chocolate chips. Or you can also have whipped cream. So first of all, you have your mug. That's the most important thing. So you get down your flour. And might make a little mess. So be ready to clean up. And you need to put four tablespoons inside your mug. Tablespoons, not teaspoons, tablespoons. One. And make them really good. Two. Three. That's so good. That's in there. You're also going to need unsweetened cocoa stuff, cocoa powder. Like that. Oh, I'm going to take this out. Yeah. And then you're going to take four tablespoons of sugar. Yeah, a lot of sugar. I know. Four tablespoons of sugar. One. Four tablespoons of that. And then you're gonna put this stuff. And then you're gonna take your Hershey's cocoa powder, actual unsweetened, open it up. Now this is probably gonna be pretty messy, so be careful with this. And y'all have to take, try to make this really good too. Either one heaping spoon tablespoon or two tablespoons. Usually I do two tablespoons. And try to make these ones really good, like the flour too. So yeah, you have all that. Then I am just gonna mix together all my ingredients with the spoon. All my dry ingredients. With the spoon. So yeah. And then I'm gonna crack the egg in here. It's so hard. So, yeah, and then crack the egg in there. And then, yeah. Is that good? Okay. So, then whisk the one egg. Whisk it. Whisk it really well, really, really well. That is whisked really well. Now you're done with your whisk. Put that in the sink. Take, you put two tablespoons of eggs inside the mug. One. Now this could get pretty messy. Two. So yeah, now I'm just going to clean all the egg off of my camera thing.
after that, you're almost done. So take a splash of pure vanilla. Now, since I couldn't find the chocolate chips, which kind of sucks because it's better with chocolate chips, I... So just a splash of vanilla. And that's good. And the chocolate chips, I'm not, like, it honestly makes it better. But, yeah. I didn't have chocolate chips. Well, I do, but I don't know where they are. So they mix this together really, really well. Like, yeah, really well. Okay, I don't think this is working. It's getting like doughy-ish. Oh wow, I forgot the milk. So need milk. Forgot. And you need two tablespoons of milk. Now this is probably gonna get messy. So I'm gonna do this insanely carefully. Because the milk is like just got it new yesterday. So it's like pretty full. So yeah, we have the milk. Can't believe I forgot the milk. Okay, so we put the milk in. Add up really well. That's why it didn't work. Now it's gonna work better. Can't believe I forgot the milk. So yeah, mix that really well. And it should get kind of liquidy. And then make sure like you like go through it really well. Like the bottom there's probably still dry flour like there was for me. And yeah, just and this is makes it a really good chocolate cake. That you make the microwave. So mixy, mixy, mix. I'm just gonna get all the dry ingredients from the bottom and get them all mixed together. Wait, I forgot something else. Oh my god. Okay, I feel so stupid. You also get two tablespoons of vegetable oil. I keep on forgetting things. Two tablespoons of vegetable oil. Can't believe I'm forgetting all this. So, two tablespoons of that. And then you mix all of that together. See, mix, see. And I'm just gonna make sure that nothing is dry at the bottom. Okay. Yeah, I still have some flour at the bottom that's dry. It's gonna get kind of thick. Like, yeah, pretty thick. But don't worry, it's still good. So, yeah, so I'm just going to try to get all the stuff that's still in the food out into there. Yeah, so, and then, you, it might be kind of messy, but whatever, and you put it in the microwave for three minutes, three minutes. So I'll make part two of what it is after those three minutes, so goodbye.